Hey everybody, it's Zelda Player 20, and actually I'm not going to give you a new episode, no, this time it's actually an old episode. Uh, you already saw me uh, doing this for like, I think it was on for 5 hours, but the audio was a complete failure, so... Uh, thanks to the viewers that actually said that to me, because I upload my videos uh, before I'm going to bed, so... I was actually watching my video later on when it was uploaded and everybody was complaining about the uh, audio commentary that it wasn't a very bad quality. So, yeah, basically I'm giving it a new touch, so hopefully it will be better. Anyway, like I promised, we're going to the Pit of 100 Trials and oh god, no, that did oh. Well, we're just going to do this battle anyway. Um, like I said in the previous episodes, uh, this time we are actually having uh, stronger enemies like the Ambrose. And, well, we're getting actually... I'm just going to show you off how underleveled I'm actually are for uh, the Pit of 100 Trials. I get 4 star points from the Hammer Bro, so... Ah, god damn it! I wanted to super guard that! Oh, sh... Well, let's just finish him and... Get a lot of stylishes! Why not? Anyway, um, I told you that I'm going to cut out all the battles of uh, the Pit of 100 Trials. Well, I'm not going to do that. Uh, I thought, like, that's just... Then I can actually completely uh, delete the uh, Pit of 100 Trials, and I'm not going to do that. So... I'm just going to the Pit of 100 Trials. Uh, for the ones that don't know the Pit of 100 Trials, uh, the Pit of 100... Damn it! Like I was saying before I got interrupted, Bit of 100 trials for the ones who don't know how it works. Um, simply, it's uh, yeah, you're going into a pit of 100 uh, rooms, and the deeper you go, uh, the more harder the enemies is going to be. And every 10 room, 10 room, sorry, bad English again. Uh, you get a badge, a reward. So, in the first room, we encounter a Dark Goomba. Dark Goombas are not really that powerful. They have 7 HP. And their attack power is normal, I believe. So, not really a hard boss. So, I'm just going to rush through this. And, Dry Bones, you're going to die! Widow Colors, a lot of stylish points. Yay. Well, I'm not going to get a lot of star points from these battles. Because, yeah... They are very easy in the beginning. Anyway, you defeat the enemy, the pipe will come, and then uh, you actually travel further and going deeper into the Pit of 100 Trials. So, here we have actually a very common uh, enemy that we had in <laughs> Chapter 1, well, before Chapter 1, actually. Um, they actually will spin at you, and uh, I thought it was one damage that they can give, but they don't have a lot of HP. I thought they were uh, 3 HP. You know what, I'm going to wrap this up, I'm just going to do a special move because I don't want to waste FP already, so... Earth Travel time it is! Okay, that's a terrible sound, that's going to be very annoying, I'm not going to do that again. <laughs> I'm sorry! Well, I'm actually using this attack a lot, you know, because uh, mostly it's very useful when you do want to do 6 damage to everybody. And it actually doesn't count defense, so if there is enemy... There are some enemies that actually have defense like 3 or 4. And when you actually use this attack, you will actually take... Uh, yeah, damage... You don't have to worry about defenses of the enemy, so it's not really that hard. And I want to have the flower power! Well, it doesn't make any sense because I have full, but oh well. Anyway, in this episode I want to apologize uh, to... Uh, yeah, Caveman300, like... Uh, he wanted to be in the co-commentating and that was a failure, like I uh, explained in the beginning of this video, so... Very sorry for that. I blame my recorder for that, but oh well. Next time you can be in the Skype, let's put it that way. Also, a special thanks to everybody that's, uh, yeah, sent me the comment like, uh, dude, you have to fix this, it's really horrible to watch it. So, again, my apologies, sorry! So many videos going on, sometimes I make a little mistake as well, huh? Anyway, room number four. Dry bones galore. Yay. Yeah, seriously, in the beginning, the battles are not really that happy, you know, not, not that interesting to watch, but I will try to make it funny, but oh well. Here I'm just going to blow them to smithereens! Boom! 
Actually, a waste of FP. Oh well. So, we get a lot of... Well, not a lot of coins. Only three. Lame. Let's go to room number four. Four, four. And then we actually have Fuzzy! Dude, it's been a long time. How are you? If you forgot what fuzzies are, fuzzies have an attack power of 1, have an HP of you, you can actually see the bar so I don't have to explain that. And they can suck out your HP and that's just gross. Well, I'm just going to change to Koops because he can actually uh, destroy all those weak enemies uh, with only 3 FP instead of 9 FP and it will actually save a lot, so... Yay, another star piece, I'm so happy! Star piece, star point! Uh. Oh, three coins and an item. Well, I am full of items. Uh, HP drain actually allows you to... Yeah, I thought it was 5 HP that you can drain from an enemy, but it's not really a useful item, so I'm just ignoring it. Oh, I love these guys! These guys can actually take you uh, more rooms below. So, when you actually encounter them, you will pay 10... Uh, coins for two rooms and 30 coins for five rooms. They are really handy in the beginning phase because it's just boring in the beginning. So, level eight, nice. Oh well, anyway, yeah, we already encountered these enemies. Um, I really recommend that you do this after uh, chapter five because you have Barbary and you have uh, Sweet Feast, I believe that was called. Because, yeah, if you are short on HP or FP, you can actually use that without using an uh, item. And take a lot of whack a bumps uh, with you as well, just for emergency. And also a live room, it's really recommended. And if I'm not mistaken, I have... I don't know what I have. Uh, I thought it was a, a, a super shroom, but... Oh well. Oh no, it was a bushy, now I remember. Because bushies are a must. Anyway, room number nine. whoop de doo Well, here you actually see that, uh, yeah, they have defense of one, the dull bones. They are not called dry bones, my apologies, they are called dull bones. But they have defense of one and, uh, well, we can actually... What the hell is that? Oh, let's see. Uh, swap spawn on HP and FP. Ah, fuck it, I don't need that. It's actually very handy when you are low on FP, but then you will actually put your uh, partner in uh, low HP, so that's not really handy. Well, anyway, our first item is the Sleepy Stump. It can actually... S uh, it's, it's not a really perfect ba badge, you know. You can use it and then it will put enemies to sleep. Uh, not a really handy item, if you ask me. Okay, here we encounter the Dark Paragoombas. Also, same HP. I thought it was 7. Yes, yeah, 7. The uh, only difference is that they fly. And here we also encounter the Piders from uh, the Lost Woods. I mean the Woods, you know, Chapter 2. So we're not going to encounter a lot of Star Points here as well. Information, information. Swing ball. That was a swing ball fail. I'm normally doing it like swing ball. Anyway, in the last uh, in the last episode, somebody actually commented that I was picking on Coops and uh, Dark Link too much. I actually don't understand. I make fun of them all the time because, uh, well, they are yay another tiny puny. You actually remember that one from Chapter Two in the store? Uh, you can actually see him there. Do I have enough for thirty? Ah, damn it! Well, then the two rooms. I don't care. Yay! So happy. Sorry, Nintendo Creepies, I just had to use it once. Oh well. Anyway, they were saying that I was picking on... Uh... Oh, it's a Dark Puff, if I'm not mistaken. Oh well, who cares. Dark Puffs are just annoying. They can actually charge up their electricity and then attack with 5 or 3 damage or something. They don't have a lot of HP, so you don't have to worry about them in this kind of stage in the game. No, but I'm not picking on Coops and Dark Link. I mean, the voices that I use for them, uh, many people enjoy them, many people actually think it's uh, kind of stupid that Coops has an old man's voice. Uh, I was actually trying to impersonate the Luigi's voice, you know, like, but Mario! Yeah, well, uh, it's Coops' voice, so... <laughs> ah, bad form. Ah. 
I actually forgot in which room we are right now. Silly me. Oh well, I will check it later. Oh well. More piders, huh? Damn. Come on. There we go. Pokey! We have a Pokey. Pokies are really easy enemies to defeat. They only have 4 HP, so uh, I'm just going to power shell them. It's easier. Ah! Pwned by my burp! Yay! I promise you that later stages actually is going to be more interesting, you know, but... Oh well. Let's see, how long are we recording right now? 11 minutes and 28 seconds? Oh, well, that's okay. Another Paragoomba. Mm. Now, later on, the enemies are going to be much more difficult. I, will, I think I will get a level up, like, 3 level up, 4 level ups, I hope. Because I'm really on the level right now, so, oh well. Yeah, normally I actually have live audio commentary, but... Because the audio commentary failed on the last episode, uh, well, on the last recording session. I'm doing it really not live right now, but oh well. Gives me more time to focus on the audio commentary, right? I wanted to super guard that you stupid party, you heated coops. You heat it? Hit it, stupid. Oh, oh well. Oh well. Come on! Yeah! 30 coins! I'm so happy. So happy. Uh, <laughs> I must stop doing that. Yeah, I'm actually watching a lot of Nintendo Capricious videos lately. It's really hilarious and I'm going to skip five. Holy shit! No, I didn't want to do that! It was stupid! Oh god! Oh, let me see how stupid was it. Oh god, I forgot the badge in level in room 20. Oh shit! Ugh. Oh well. New enemy in the pit of 100 trials. They only have 5 HP. I don't know their names, but they can steal your en uh, your items. So I'm talking about those red shit guys with the mean face. So you really want to destroy them very fast. Anyway, the boost has 7 HP. Boost actually attack with, I thought, 4 HP. And don't you dare to throw a rock at me. Hey, Ouija's in the crowd again. Ouija! Oh well, how am I going to do this? Um, let's see. I think I'm going to do a run on Coop. So the thieves are going to be defeated. So we don't have to worry about stealing items anymore. So now we actually... Yeah, I'm thinking of... Yeah, let's just destroy a boo and let's see what the other boo is going to do. Yay! Stylish! Uh, oh, can we have a bing... Ah, lame. Ah, boo shit! Now I can't attack him. Oh, uh, well, you're just going to... Uh, yeah, well, uh, defend mode. Doesn't make any much sense, but I'm going to defend as well. Amazing. Yay. Kill him. Boink. Boink. Yay. Do I get more star point? No, of course not. Lame. Anyway, that wraps it up for this episode. In the next episode, we're going to start with room 23. So thank you all for watching. This is Elder Player 20, signing off. Stay tuned for more, folks.